This morning, water managers are raising the flows of the Boise River again. KBNY2's Lauren Clark explains how it could affect your favorite areas of the Greenbelt. Well, if you've been on the Greenbelt lately, most likely you've probably seen signs like this, like the one behind me here, closed signs. And a lot of these trails will remain closed because water managers are set to rise the level of the Boise River both today and tomorrow. Now, right now, water reservoirs are about half full. And while that may seem low, water managers want them even lower right now. They say they haven't seen this kind of flow in over 10 years and are planning for what's yet to come this season. Well, we're, we're making space in the reservoir system because we know there's still a lot more snow that's going to melt. So uh, we're working on uh, maintaining some space in the system to catch that when it happens. Water managers say this is all precautionary and additional flooding will be subtle. So to give you an idea of what that means right now, the river is about 10 and a half feet deep. They're planning to raise it to just 10.8 feet deep. Also, the folks at the Bureau of Reclamation do want to tell you this. They say, please keep in mind the signs. They're there for your own good. So if you see a close sign on the trail, don't go near the water. The water is actually really, really fast and really cold right now, much faster and colder than it may appear. Reporting live here in Boise, Lauren Clark, KBOI 2 News. This morning, the Payette River is back below flood stage, but not before causing some problems. Like yesterday, take a look at these photos from a viewer in New Plymouth. You can see flooding across fields and roads right up next to homes. Payette County is making sand available at several locations, including the county fairgrounds.